Yo, what's poppin', man? It's your boy, Bad Whistle, man. Young Money, Cash Money, man. Y'all say I'm in the spot, like always, man. You know, if I'm in the spot, it's crazy. Chill. in london you know what i mean we got the brand new uh brand new single with two singles out right now currently better featuring t-pain and then uh, my first official single we in the club which we just shot the video for that that'll be out uh probably like in a week and a half you know uk has always been like you know one of my biggest markets in europe of course especially london so it's almost like a why not plus that's all they be asking me on twitter anyway man when you coming back to london when you coming i want to bring you nando's bow wow when you coming back when you coming back so I'm here, man. I'm here, and the presence is definitely felt, so I'm excited to be back. It's crazy how uh, the whole me and Sneak situation happened. I mentioned his name in an interview uh, my last trip over to the UK, which was probably like two and a half months ago. I was just in London like two and a half months ago. And I mentioned his name, and, and, and I want to say he hit me on Twitter. And that's kind of how it all started from Twitter, and, and I started following him. and. Um, from that it became like yo let's do a record one day and just just last night it wasn't even about work and the music it was just our first time meeting each other in person and we were just vibing talking about life just you know catching up and getting to know one another and you know we spoke about the business and he asked me questions about you know how it is in the states and um, dude is, is definitely a cool kid humble guy man I, I like him I think he's talented and uh, like I said I like real people man he's definitely a real guy man and I like being being around real um, People you know Chris worked with Chipmunk. Um, you know I know he's a big artist. Tiny Temple's a big artist over here, of course. <laughs> you know what I mean. So uh, these are guys that uh, you know that I, I definitely would definitely like to take the time out to listen to more of their material and for us to you know see what, see what we can go with it. But I'm always open to working with you know different people. For me, it's really kind of like really been the same. The only thing that's changing is just the game. You know everything is seasonal. Everything is a cycle. You know what I mean music is no different than life. You know it has its own form of changes. So um, if anything. That's really it, just seeing the game change every summer odd two and a half years. From, you know, baggy clothes to now we don't wear baggy shit no more. You know what I mean? Now everything is fitted. Now it's cool to wear extra, extra small. It, it used to be you get your ass laughed at for wearing an extra, extra small. So it's just things like that that I see changing. And it's weird because I'm still young. Like I started young and I'm still young. I'm only 25. So, you know, um, you know, it's weird. It's weird that for 13 years I've been young. <laughs> For my career, I just really wanted that flexibility to pretty much do whatever it is that I wanted to do. Uh, creatively, being hands on my music, being in charge, and that's what I get. You know, over there, it's just, you know, you get signed, but you know, Stunner wants you to be your own boss. He's not gonna babysit you. He's not gonna tell you what records you need to put out, what you need to do. You should automatically know what you need to do. You know what I mean? And this is the big leagues. Just expect some hard shit, man. Like, just real music. Just, you know, when I say real, I mean like, you know, things that'll move you, things that'll things that you might not have known I was feeling and just, you know, the connection I'm trying to bring, the bond I'm trying to bring with myself and the people, just letting them know like, yo, I'm no different than y'all. You know, I went through a lot of things in my personal life for me having a kid and everything like that that a lot of people always want to ask questions about that I'm very closed, you know, mouth to, I don't really speak on them type of things, but all that type of energy is being ref is, is being displayed on the album. So you get that, you get the first time you hear about when I was talking about a kid. A lot of people still look at me like I'm on myself. So people to hear me talk about that is different. The lyrical content is different. Um, I mean, I'm a different man. Man, 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 man. Hey, yo, what up, man? All in our productions, man. It's your boy, Bad Wizzle, man. Cash money, young money. I'm too cold. That's why I got my hoodie on. You did. <laughs>